This video is about polygonal walls in Albania. This is the first video and probably the last since I'm terrible at it. I made this because I'm obsessed with polygonal walls. I've seen most of what YouTube has to offer on the subject, plus I pick my travel destinations to wherever I can find these constructions. What are polygonal walls? Well, no time for that now. Sufficient to say, it's a worldwide ancient mystery in stone. One that archaeology can't or isn't willing to understand. From Peru to Japan, in most of the Mediterranean, we can find these constructions and I made my personal goal to go and visit as much as I can. Recently, I've been in Albania, that sits right in the middle of two hotspots for these constructions, Italy and Greece, so it should have some and it certainly does. Since Albania is not yet very touristic and there are hardly any videos about polygonal walls in that country, I felt I had something to show. Of all the polygonal locations in Albania, Lecce is by far the most impressive, with a set of walls that extends for over 2 kilometers. Lecce is in the middle of Albania's central plain, around a hill that has some military value. So much so, the national hero Skanderbeg did set his castle in town. The medieval castle just highlights the mystery of the polygonal walls, as it's a rougher and smaller and cheaper construction, and even the layout hints that how the ancient polygonal walls were not so convincing as a fortress. The ancient walls, as usual in these constructions, they create a flat surface on top of a hill, an acropolis, that extends downwards in a sort of um, processional way. Historians say these walls were built by the local Illyrian tribes or by Greek settlers just around the 4th century BC. The first reference, thus the dating, comes from the city being conquered by the Macedonians, just around the time of Philip Alexander's father. For such a large fortification, one can wonder why did the locals hardly put up with a fight, or even why there's indication that the fight happened in the mountains behind, again suggesting the walls were not so good for defense. The quality of the stone work and fitting of the polygonal walls is excellent, as good as some of the best southern Greek examples. However, the walls back in Greece are said to be from the 12th or 14th century BC and from the Mycenae, that's almost a millennium apart and therefore an impossible connection. What we can surely know is that the massive construction and amazing skill was there before anybody else. The best construction is the oldest. Later usage is limited to cheaply reassembling stones for other purposes, something even the modern times Albanian government did with an ugly monument in a rotunda. Overall, Ledze shows off the typical polygonal mystery, an acropolis, artworks with a flat top, not so good for defense, impossible construction skills better than anything that followed over the millennia, awful lazy dating from historians that somehow are not captivated by the mystery. Hope you liked the video and please comment and subscribe so that I'll make more of this and hopefully improve.